so we got a call for a Jeep that's stuck in the snow up on Cedar Mountain. So we've got the snow cat on the back here. We're going to head up there and see if we can get them out. We have got a truck entirely full of people. All kinds of crew members and tag-alongs. So we're going to stop at Tim's house and he's going to jump in his classic Saturn wagon. And uh, I think we'll throw a couple people in there. Rhett, you can go in there and that way I can have my armrest back. Mm. Yeah. Got the weather for us, Ed? Yeah, it's clear. Uh, nice day, but it's windy and a little cold. And we'll go up in the snow and get them out. All right, so we got everybody dropped off. Rudy decided to go too. That gives Randy lots of room in the yeah, back. I can sleep back here now. What temperature would you say it is here? I imagine it's 45 with the wind blowing. All right, Ed, we just went up the Black Ridge, so we need an updated weather report. It's cloudy and snowing up on the ridge, so we'll probably get a little white on our shoulders. Maybe that's the guy. Yeah, that's that was it. Jump in. Thank you, guys. How are you doing? Good, how are you? <laughs> you want to tell us what happened? Well, I was going down to a, a hiking trail, and I've gone on that road in the snow before a couple of times. And then heading back out, it just started slipping, and then I couldn't get any traction. What were you driving? Uh, 2014 two-door Jeep JK. Oh, so capable is it, So are you just, is it just too slippery, or are you buried in snow? Um, it's in a little bit of snow. Not that much, but the wheels just keep on spinning. I tried to get myself out, and then I ended up having to hike a mile back to the main road, and then uh, hitchhike back down the mountain. Is there a fuel station up here? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so either. Matt's Super Duty has the smallest tank of any Ford truck out there for some reason. We didn't get too far, but dang. <laughs> How did I miss the fuel? That corner. Actually, come to think of it, I don't think I can make this corner. I think you're gonna be perfect. So this gas station to get here, you have to drive five miles up the canyon. Turn around that. and come back. Yeah. <laughs> you got it now, Tim. Why you back it up? <laughs> the Saturn can do it. I want to keep it nice. <laughs> in this thing. You heard it. Take your coat off, Randy. Take it off. I ain't taking my coat off. Fight me, Rudy. <laughs> well, that reminds me. That <laughs> hurt. I know, you went down hard. <laughs> okay, let's get the snow off again. Ow, oh, bruised. Okay. <laughs> this is just ridiculous. This is the, this is the sin signal. Okay, to stop. I guess this is my job today, huh? Yeah. Well. Okay. Rudy, you're in there. I rolled down both windows. 
Okay. So roll up on the dashboard. Tim, you get in there. Ben, you doing good? I'm freezing. I'm freezing over here. I'm gonna run back up this mountainside. This is for you guys. Thanks for those that appreciate it. Do you want to drive it out from here? I knew I wasn't in trouble. Have a good day tomorrow while you're at it. Man, I got nothing. A lot of ice in the snow. Okay, we got up there, unloaded the snow cat and about a foot and a half of snow, and went about a mile up there and then down a hill and found him. He'd got turned around and stuck, and, and uh, it was a little pull getting him out. Matt done a good job. We got him out, got the snow cat loaded, or headed home, and thanks for watching. We got a call today. Um... My dad's out of town. He's helping uh, Paul at Fab Rats get uh, Papa Dar's Jeep put together. So we're heading out to the dunes to recover a side-by-side -side that has broken belt of some kind. And there are four people with it. So it's gonna be tight. But uh, we'll go up there and uh, get them out. Who's got a good weather report today? It's windy and cold. Not looking forward to driving in that side by side all the way back. Hopefully it's got a wind chill. It probably doesn't though. <laughs> it's 44 degrees Fahrenheit. We'll go get them out. Rudy's beating us up back here. It's a pretty oh. rough ride today. <laughs> oh shush, I'm gonna put you in the side by side and sandblast you. <laughs> You haven't happened to see a broke down side by side up there, have you? We haven't, but we're headed up there, and if we do, we'll flip you and we'll tell you guys. All right. Ah, cool.
How you doing? Good man, how are you? You guys been waiting long? Uh, not too long. Maybe. <laughs> No wind chill. It's a little chilly in this yeah, rig, huh? Yeah, not too bad. <laughs> Degrees. <laughs> Good. I'm gonna try something. Pull from the center. That'll be a change. Okay, you guys ready? Awesome. So it is a house in town then. No, it's I think it's a shop. It's kind of like a Okay, well. Yeah, that's right by our shop. <laughs> we know where you're at. <laughs> So was this as fun yeah, under the think. Jeep power as it is under its own power? Maybe it'll even a little bit more fun. <laughs> that was great. You guys know what you're doing. Loved it. Yeah. It, it was a lot of fun, man. <laughs> cool. Did a good job. Got us back safe and sound. Can't complain, right? Nice. Hey, Tim, give them a shirt. What size shirt do you wear? Oh, oh XL. I was about to ask. I want a shirt for sure. <laughs> <laughs> We do we do one. That's why I was asking oh, who made oh, the call. Rock, paper, scissors. You two and then you two and then the winner. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors. Oh. What? Alright, you two. Scissors or Rock, paper, scissors. Oh! Alright, she gets it. No problem. That's perfect. <laughs> thank you. Well, hey, you have a good one, yeah, Merry Christmas. Thank you so much. Yeah, happy